Have you ever looked into the mirror and noticed, or has anybody ever told you that you have a large bump at the base of your neck? Now this is due for many reasons, more specifically for an extended amount of time in a seated position working at a computer or staring down at your cell phone for many hours. Now when you're in that position, what it does, it causes your neck to shift forward and to compensate for that, your upper back is going to get extra stiff leading to that bony bump on the base of that neck. There are many things that you can do on your own, many stretches, many exercises to help prevent this from occurring or help it from progressing to something larger. The first exercise that you can do is the chin retraction. So you're not gonna tilt your chin down, you're not gonna tilt it up, you're gonna hold it level and you're gonna slide it back hold it for about 10 seconds, and you're gonna do about 10 reps of those. You can do it periodically throughout the day. What that does, it helps build the strength in your neck flexor muscles, which is gonna keep your, the spine and curvature of your neck the way it's supposed to be. Number two, you could do the foam roller in the upper back. Now foam rolling, it's very good for helping reduce muscle tension while improving mobility in that upper back to prevent that bump from occurring. What you wanna do is you wanna lay on that tender spot in your upper back, roll, do about 10 rolls back and forth, or find a tender spot and hold it there till that muscle tension feels right. Number three, you wanna do the pec wall stretch. Now when your chest and your pec muscles are tight, what it does, it causes your shoulders to round forward and that leads to that bony bump in the back of your neck. Now what you wanna do is find a corner of the wall, hold it in that position for about 20 to 30 seconds and do about three to four repetitions. Hi, I'm Dr. Bobby with Energized Chiropractic and Wellness. Go to energizedchiro.com for more information.